We're at the Allergic Stadium in Lost Wages. And I am ready to gamble, Grim. Which slot has the best odds and wages? Uh, that would be the ATM, Bricks. Oh, good. I'll play that one, then. Yeah, this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Lost Skinless Volts take on the Lost Wages Invaders. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim, I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bloodmobile park next to the taco truck outside. Called a lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bull crap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mouth looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. Hot one, hot two, hot three. A new set of downs. And whoever said never hit a man when he's down is just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, It'll be fun to gamble with my own teeth! <laughs> hot two! Hot two! Hot, hot, hot. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks! Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks! You're an idiot. Turn. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, what a brutal hit! <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hit. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed anyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but you know, not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? I don't really know right now. What day is it? And it's first and ten. Runs it for four yards. Second down and six. Oh, and the defense jumps up. And that unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's Drive Through Funeral Parlor Service, located just off the Beltway exit five. Second down and six. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. He moves him, so he tossed the 
ball out of bounds. Good move. Oh, my God. A man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. pick up there. Third down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And the ball razors through the defense coming into the Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. That's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. One, hot two, hot, 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 hot. shoved up your ass. Quite the description of that painful hit, Junior. Huh? No, no, it's a question here on this online dating profile. It doesn't say if on purpose or by accident. Yeah, I'll leave it blank. And it's first and ten. Go <laughs> man about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Third down and five. Nelly, offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I gotta see that one again. It was also freaking awesome! I hope they have raincoats in the front row, cause that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. Quarterback <laughs> passes for a touchdown! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run.
And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And a nice pass for a ten-yard gain. It's not a first down in the stat line, but it's a first down in our hearts. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Hot two. Hot Line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. Playing a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. up eight yards on that pass. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. If he had getting killed by a chain lock, his legs flying everywhere in a shower of blood. And that's just a concession stand. I can't even begin to describe what's happening on the field. short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm. That's bleak, Bricks. And it's good! You know, when in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die! First and ten. Wow! The 
quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his receiver and punched his way out of that tackle. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is on... Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. <laughs> First and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. meets the explodable object. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Three. First up. Oh, mama! Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. Cap, you came for time. I only we get how much. It's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Oh, uh, you're telling me. Second down and long. Hot. hot one, hot two, hot. We're at the two minute warning and we'll take a quick timeout. Graham, will you tell the interns to get us some Frank and dogs and a couple of beers? I'm dry over here. I'll take nachos and a scotch. Uh, Looks like a pee for me, too. Hot two, hot. hot. Oh, it's a brain scrambler. And they take their first timeout. Uh, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out there in halftime. Third down and long. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. That fair play nets them seven yards. Oh, no. I got the hiccups again. What is... Either the defense is trying to keep some time on the clock for their offense, or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on MFL Game Day. Uh, MFL straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's
It's first and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. And it's first and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham and sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, then. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. Perfect pass and a score! And here comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And the defense gives up five yards there. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. This guy's a brick shithouse. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Ah, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. Hot, hot, one, hot, two, hot, 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 hot. that and the offense goes into their two-minute drill which coincidentally happens to be Brit's match stopping time that's why the girls call me speedy gonzalez well it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it you gotta keep your eye on the ball come on and that's the end of the second quarter someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers Stay with us for the Halftime Show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the carnage during today's Halftime Show. Obviously, they need to play a lot harder here in the second half to make a game of it. Or they can start cheating and killing. That's what I do. Yeah, man, I was going to stand on now. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. glue 
second down and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? Hey, yeah, uh, Bricks, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. I won't even get out of First and goal. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps on sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the offense. And that's how you get your buzz on in the NFL. And I'm two fifths into this bottle of scotch. He's at the 40. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. It sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. And it's first and ten. Just crushed him. <laughs> I gotta see that again. I had a kid once like that walking down the sidewalk, texting with his earbuds in. Freaked him out. He said, "Hey, what'd you do that for?" I said, "I teach you a lesson." What lesson? He said that unless. And the defense jumps on sides, trying to. You know, in some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> The offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. And it's first and ten. And an eight-yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' mom decided to move back in with us. Second down and two. keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? The 20. The 10. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's warming down his guy than a speed feed grim. He's running from his team. I won't even The offense lost their final quarterback. Lucky for them, they're on defense now or the game would be over. Uh, so all the other team has to do is punt the force of forfeit? That would be correct, Bricks. <laughs> now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters. The kick is good! As expected, they it pretty much just... Invaders devastate the opposition at home. The opposing team can't feel the team, so this one ends in a forfeit. That was one hell of a slugfest. That was worth the price of admission, right, guys? I pay for admission, I expect girls to dance out of pool or something. Girls, man, I want a lap dance. You don't even have a lap, you little freakazoid. Call me. Let's see what the MVP has to say about today's outcome. Yeah. <laughs> 
Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.